series of Games Master. Unfortunately, it's welcome to the last show of the series. Over the past 26 weeks or six months for viewers in Swindon, we've mined this shaft for all it's worth. But before we go, it's time to sign off with a flourish as we go over to the Games Master. Good evening. I hope you're comfortably settled into the Games rig. We initiate tonight's proceedings with um, a primitive adventure on Shadow of the Beast 3. I've opted for the forest stage, and I'd like you to get through the level in one and a half minutes or less. With um, hostile beasts and cavemen to contend with, I expect more than a few fatalities. Um, don't let me down. Making the beast with two backs on this challenge is David Newland from Exmouth. Lovely. Now, David, what does a funky young dude like yourself get up to in Exmouth? Well, not much, except watch the Games Master, of course. Oh, check, what's this guy like, eh? Listen, is it also true, David, you've been nicking Mars bars from the oil rig supplies? Oh, well, only a few from my friends up there. <laughs> only a few of your friends. So, Auntie Marisha was right about that. All right, well, listen, the best of luck anyway with the challenge, David. If you'd like to sit yourself down, get ready to begin. Well, I can always tell it's going to be a good day when Tom Watson from Renegades with me. Welcome, Tom. Hello, Dominic. Now, Tom, Beast 3, give us some tips. OK, well, it's not all hack and slash. That's the important thing for him to remember here. There's a little bit of thinking to do, some puzzles to solve. So he's got to mix the two styles. OK, he's also got to be very, very quick because David only has one and a half minutes to get to the level and kill the end of level body. David, are you ready? Yep. Your one and a half minutes begin now. OK, off he goes here now. He's got a little shuriken weapon just now. He's dispatching with some That's of these little Neanderthals here. That's right, he's getting rid of them. Well, here, here we can see the start of the first puzzle. It's this right. uh, rather large leg of something. Now, what's he doing with this? Well, he's, he's got to move it underneath that trap. You see the way the trap's swinging yes, with the spikes? Swinging there. Obviously, if he'd walked under it, would he have been totaled? Yeah, he would indeed. It would have come down on top of him. So he's, what he's got to do is he's got to lure something else to go right. under it for him. Oh, huge, big, humongous and beast from the pits of Nazi Hell. That's right. I think that may be it. There okay, he goes. He's following him. He's, he's chasing him up the rear. Him. Now, let's see what happens. Let's see if he can set up the he's trap. He's been gone for 40 seconds here. We see the monster. Whoa! Oh, and there he goes. Yeah, the monster's totaled. He gets no. a bonus gold. Now he's got a balance on this ledge. He's picked, picked up the rock. Up That's the obviously going to be a useful. That makes the balance. Okay, now he's going to push the rock over the other side. 52 seconds gone. Here it goes. There we go. That lowers that next Gives one down. Gives it a little bit more weight. He it down. Okay, he's coming up for a minute. He's got 30 seconds left. Okay, tricky stuff here. Oh, oh he's been hit a bit. We can see there. his energy bar at the bottom left-hand corner of the screen. That's right. The far left test tube. Half there, but he's been through that. That's one of the nastiest areas of the whole level. 20 seconds left, though. It's going to be quite tight here, Tom. Here we go. He's Well, he's doing well. He's getting very, very close 15 indeed. 15 seconds left. Here, and he's and just here's about the out of time, maybe. Here's the big, horrible, red, humongous thing here. He's got 10 seconds left. Well, Eight. Seven. He did He's it. Done he it picked with up the seven skull. seconds left. Absolutely perfect. Quite remarkable. With seven seconds left, Mars Bar Bandit David Newland has completed the challenge. <laughs> well done, David. All right. David, you had seven seconds left there at the end. A very, very commendable performance. Was there ever any, any point you felt a bit queasy? Um, yeah, just the spikes at the end. Yep, that was all. No other problems. No. 
Fine, great. Okay then, well done, David. As a result of winning the challenge, you go home with the Games Master Gordon Joystick. And now some lovely leisure software comes under the beady eye of our hand-picked pundits in this week's reviews. Tonight we bandy about obscure terms like the mystic spell of castigation as we look at role-playing games. First up, the console conversion of Dungeon Master. 20 characters and 14 levels conspire to kick in Lord Chaos. Unlike real role-playing games,